Hi guys, it's Heather and it's 4.30 in the morning. Um, this is, I, I wake up at 4 and I feed the pets and uh, I didn't sleep very well last night because I was worried about this. Um, I was thinking about weighing in today. Today is weigh-in Wednesday and I know I'm up and I'm scared of the number. Um, I did an experiment where I agreed not to weigh in for a, a month and then I waited longer because I was scared. But for me, weighing in keeps me on track and it helps me to remember um, my priorities and I can't go this long. <laughs> without weighing in or bad things happen, at least I think. So I'm going to go ahead and get it over with and um, then I'm going to show you how I make veggies in my steamer. <laughs> so um, before I weigh in, I did have a good day yesterday. I ate my vegetables and my sweet potatoes and my um, bean, uh, my white bean hummus. When I told you the recipe for the white bean hummus, I forgot to say garlic. And you guys probably know me well enough to know there's garlic in there. But it's simply white beans and lemon juice and Benson's Table Tasty and a lot of garlic. And um, it almost looks like mashed potatoes. Um, it's pretty good. Anyway, I'm going to have that on my veggies again. But um, I wanted to show you how I make the veggies because I make the veggies, you know, 4.30 in the morning. <sighs> okay, so I haven't done a weigh-in video in a long time, so I'm going to do it the way that I always have. Um, when I started out, I was over 436 pounds. I am 5'2". My stomach was more, uh, my stomach and hips were more than 90 inches around, so that made me rounder than I am tall. I have taken off a lot of weight. I have kept it off a long time. I recently had uh, a relapse where I went back to eating the things that I had eaten before, um, specifically sweets, but that was a gateway drug to other things. And so um, while I'm back on solid ground now, I'm sure there's going to be a gain, probably a lot. Um, so let's just get this over with. I'm going to, you guys are going to weigh in with me. Here's my scale. It's not normally in the middle of the kitchen floor. <laughs> I did that because I don't want to be noisy in front of the, in the bathroom in front of the kids. Wow. I don't know if you can see that. Wow, that said, that's higher than I even thought it was going to be. It says it's 248. Wow, I'm all the way back up to 248. Wow, I'm speechless. I thought it was maybe 240, just from the way my clothes are fitting. Um. I can't go that long without weighing in. I'm going to start weekly weighing in again. Um, I'm pretty upset right now, so I'm just going to process this while I'm making my veggies. Okay, let's go ahead and make veggies. So that is my steamer. It costs like $20 on Amazon.com. It was not very expensive. And I've already put some filtered water in there. You just fill it about halfway. It maybe even only takes like a cup of water. It doesn't even take very much. And it has two steamer baskets. And then to make life easy, because this is four in the morning, um, you just use these bagged veggies. And I wanted to show you, these are those sweet potato ribbons that's almost like pasta oh. and if you have something that is um, harder like carrots 
or sweet potatoes, something that's a harder consistency, I put those in the bottom basket. So I'm just dumping those in there. And I think I have two of those. And you can heap it a little bit. You can make it be above the line just a little bit because <clears throat> as they steam, they shrink down a little bit. So put that on there. And then you put the top basket on. And then if you have things like cauliflower, I'm doing cauliflower and broccoli. And more broccoli. I like broccoli. see it makes quite a bit and if you're wondering why I'm not washing these it's because these are those these are those steamer bags they're meant for people to just steam them right in the bag so they've already been really washed so you, it's just super easy you don't even have to I just put the lid on and then I'm going to set it for 30 minutes now, I would never steam my veggies for 30 minutes on the stove, but this isn't going to steam them for the whole 30 minutes because it takes um, a little while to get hot and everything, and then the ability of the steam to go from one basket to the other is going to take a little bit longer, too. But this is how I make my veggies every day, and they come out perfect. They're not mushy. I hate mushy vegetables. Cannot stand them. Um, they're not mushy and they're not too hard either. Um, carrots come out pretty firm, but I like that because I like to put them in dip kind of, but they're still a little softer. And with carrots, that makes them more bioavailable. You can get the beta carotene out of them better. So, all right, well, I'm glad to have my weigh-in over for the week. I'm going to weigh in next week. I'm not going to let this discourage me. You know, this is not um, this is not a permanent situation. Whenever I have a bad thing happen or whenever I go through something rough or if the scale's up, I'm just tell myself the truth, which is that this is as bad as it's ever going to be. I have the choice to make this the worst day this year, you know have the ability to have it all go down from here so that's what's happening my weight's going to go down from here and um, just thank you for for being with me when I'm up and when I'm down and um, all over um, I'm keeping in mind that I've still taken off a lot of weight you know close to 200 pounds kept it off a long time and if I did it before I can do it again and I'm gonna just get to work I'm not gonna waste one tear on what I can't control I, I can't control this I already did it it's done what I did is done and what I'm gonna do is completely up to me and I need my positive energy to get it done so I'm not gonna waste it on being sad or kicking myself or punishing myself or anything else. I'm just going to get to work. I hope you guys have a great day. Eat your veggies <laughs> and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.